Hey guys, it's Sim here from Flipping Disc Dogs. Uh, we're at the Team Taffite headquarters, working with Miss Risky Business here. Uh, we're going to bring you a tutorial on the hug. So Risk hasn't done this before. So um, what I've done, I've made sure that there's no distractions around because Risk is really good at shaping us <laughs> to get the behaviour rather than us shaping her. So I've moved some distractions out of the way. Um, I've got my clicker, I've got my treats, and I've also got our tool that we're using, which is an umbrella I found in the corner. Perfect. All right, so what I'm going to do to start off with, I'm going to uh, just click and treat just to charge that clicker. I don't want her jumping up, so I'm just gently going to, you know, make her hop down. Um, so click and treat until you start seeing that she's actually responding. Sit. Good. Can you drop? Good job. Okay, so I think she's got a little bit of an understanding now that we're going into business. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're just going to introduce this. I'm not going to ask of anything, just going to hold it there. I'm just going to click and treat, you know, moving it around her. So she doesn't get scared of it. That's the important thing. This is a training tool. We don't want them scared of what we're using as a tool. Yeah, good girl, she just put her paw on it. So I'm just moving it around. It's gonna to touch her. Um, you know, if it touches her and she jumps back a little bit, then we're gonna go a little bit softer on it. But just, you know, bring it to her. Sit down, good girl. Good job. Good. Now I don't know which way Risk is gonna hug yet because I'm not. She's not my dog, so I don't know if she's left or right poured yet. But I'm putting it on her left because that's what's easiest for me at the moment. Good job. Release. Okay, so I'm gonna swap hands and I'm gonna do the exactly the same thing on the other side. Oh, good girl. Oh, clicker keeps falling off. Good. Good job. Good girl, Risk. Sit down. Good job. Allowing it to touch her. She's not phased at all, which is really good. So now, the preferred side for me would uh, to have it on her left. Uh, so we're gonna start with that and see how she goes. Sit down. Good job. Sit. Good. She's going into a sit pretty, that's good. She's touching it, really good. Release her off. Bring her back in, risk and sit. Good job, bring it into her front. Good. So you're just gonna reward any behavior that she starts offering because that's all a positive when we're introducing something new. Sit, good job. Yeah, very clever girl, release her off. So when they touch it, just release them so we can reset, sit. That's a drop, but good girl. Yes, very clever girl, risk. Good job, release. Good girl, can we sit? Good. Good girl. Can you sit? Good. Now we want to start trying to get the sit back in because she's jumping up to hug. She's actually standing and hugging. So when we want a stationary um, hug, it's best if we actually got them in a sitting position because it, you know, it, it brings more stability to them. Okay, sit down. Good job. Well, you get that freebie. Good. Sit. Good. And sit. Good. And sit. Good. Good 
job and sit. Can you sit? Good. Good job. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is I've swapped hands and I'm going, I've noticed that she's actually uh, more right pawed than left pawed. So she's offering her right before she wraps her left around. So I've swapped hands with my clicker and my treats and I'm gonna introduce it to the right side of her shoulder and see what she does. Good. Now it doesn't matter she's not touching it. Um, any interaction between me and, and her and also the umbrella. See, we've swapped sides so we kind of have to start again. Can you sit? Good job. Good girl. And sit. Good. Can you? Yeah, good hug. 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 Good. Hug. Good job. Hug. Yes, good girl. Good. Sit. Sit. Good. And hug. Hug. Good. So I'm starting to use a uh, verbal hug. Good girl. Hug. Hug. Good. Yes, and sit. Good. So once you've got them constantly hugging the object, whether they're standing or sitting, make sure you put that verbal in. Um, and then once that they understand the verbal with the cue of the object, that is when you can take away that verbal and they'll know object there, hug. Okay, sit down. Good job. And hug. Good. And sit. Good. And hug. Good. And hug. And sit. And sit. Good. Good. Sit. And hug. Very good. And sit. And hug. Good girl. Well done. Sit. Good job. steps of uh, hug, risk, good girl. So as you can see, once you desensitize them to the object that you're using, it really is going to be a nice, fast, simple trick. Um, I've seen a lot of dogs sit in a, um, a big position hugging their teddy bear, which is really, really cute um, and creative idea. So, you know, once you, once you get that foundation of the hug on a solid object like an umbrella, uh, a walking stick is what we use for Daisy, uh, you can really start to use your imagination and get anything you want. So, as you saw with Risk, she hasn't seen that before. She doesn't know that behaviour, but she's very willing to work with me. And as I said, she's not my dog. Um, you know, I've been up in Queensland for a few weeks now and I have been having a play with Riss, she's a beautiful dog. Um, but again, you know, working with someone that has different cues, that uses a clicker different to what her mum does, 
you know, it, it's different for a dog and she's uh, taken to it really quickly and she's picked up that hug behaviour which is super impressive. So we'll keep working on that. Um, the next step for risk with that behaviour is to be in a stationary position and hugging for at least five seconds on her own without me holding the uh, object. So that's what we'll work on with risk. The, the hug trick, it's cute, it's fun. You can get them to hug your broom, hug your, um, the walking stick, hugging the umbrella, and then again, hugging their uh, other dogs, um, which is really, really cute as well. Um, if you're gonna do that, make sure the other dog is okay with having um, another dog put their paw on them. So it, again, it's a lot of slow steps, but we can do another tutorial on that later on. But have fun with this. Um, this is Risk and she picked up the hug trick in just one session. See ya.